All right, Brooke, what game are we playing today? Spot. Ooh, Spot It. Do you like Spot It? I like Spot It. What is Spot It about? Spot It is a speed matching game. Ooh, let's check it out. So what's so unique about it here? Any or each card only has one thing that is the same. Wow, so you could take any two cards and there's one and only one thing that matches. So what matches on there? It's the, I can't figure it out. So you're not spotting very quick on that one, Oh, huh? it's the anchor. The anchor. So take another two set of cards. And what matches there? The lips. Oh, yeah. So it's not the exact same size. This could be the apple. Nice. Wow. So you're trying to match all those things up. Is it hard sometimes? Yeah, because oh. sometimes it's really small and big on the other and you can't really. So the sizes right. are different, but... Well, cool. Well, what's the objective of Spot It? It depends. What do you mean, it depends? It depends on what game you're playing. Huh? You got multiple ways to play it. Hot potato, potato, the well, the tower, and the poisoned gift. Awesome. So there's multiple different ways to play it? Mm -hmm. So what's hot potato? Hot potato is you have one card in your hand. Each person has one card in their hand. Okay. And at the same time, you flip it over. Uh-huh. And you try and give your card to another player, and you don't get any more because they can't match anything in your hand. So you're just trying to get rid of so your cards. if they so had this card, uh -huh. I would have to hurry and figure out what's the exact same, and it would be the raindrop. I would say raindrop and put it in the hand. And then, and then they would have to get rid of this and then that. Wow. And so the last person with one? With all of them. Loses. Yeah. Okay. Well, what's the next way? The next way is the tower. Ooh. Each person has one card in front of them. Mm-hmm. And this is up, facing up. Okay. And what you're trying to do is at the same time you flip it over and you're trying to match these. So I would go snowflake and you're trying to get as many as you can until this runs out and then you count and whoever has the most wins. Okay, cool. So you're just going through that whole tower. What's the next one? The next is the well. Ooh, okay. And the well is you, there's only one card in the middle and everybody has their own stack. Okay. But the good thing about this one is the people that can't spot very well, they can get a lower stack and the people that can do it really fast can get a higher amount. So it's a good way to even it out by just giving different... So you could just go like this and you're supposed to put it into here. You'd have to flip it and say what's the exact same, which would be the lips, and you put it in and just keep doing it until you run out. Cool. Okay, and then the last one? The last one, the poisoned gift, is my favorite. Oh, why is that? Because there is this whole thing in the middle, okay. and you each have one card. Okay. And what you're trying to do is you're trying to get these on different cards. So for this, I could say carrot and give it to them, or I could say art and give it to them. So you're trying to give it away, so the yeah. lowest stack wins, huh? So why is that a good one? Because the people that are really good at it, everybody can gang up on that person. Ah. And... So it's a good way to balance out the odds, huh? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so a lot of fun, quick matching. Yep. So what would your rate spot it? 4.5. Ooh, a very high one. Mm -hmm. You think everybody should have this? Mm-hmm. All right, thanks, Brooke. Yep.